Hey y'all, it's your girl Mani Sawari here. I am the founder of Sawari Media. Sawari Media distributes prisoner news media in the form of newsletters to people all across the United States. A beautiful privilege of having the honor of corresponding with hundreds of people in prison. I get a lot of mail. And I use this series to share some excerpts from those pieces of mail with you beautiful people. And today we're going to be looking at a commissary form. So let's get to it. This commissary form was sent to me, uh, a prisoner who's in the SHU, actually. If you don't know what SHU is, it stands for Segregated Housing Unit. And it's where people go when the prison doesn't know what else to do. All right, so this commissary order form has been mailed to me out of MDOC, Michigan's Department of Corrections. And here we can see exactly how much it costs and what type of things people in prison have to spend their money on. People always think like, oh, why do people in prison need to make a minimum wage? Why does it matter if they're paid anything? This is why it matters. People in prison are served two to three meals a day. I say two to three because at some facilities in order to get breakfast, you gotta wake up at six, seven, eight a.m. And not everybody trying to do that. Not everybody trying to do that, okay? Especially after being in a loud, toxic, violent environment 24-7, I might need some extra Zs. And breakfast, don't slap. It don't slap, okay? So let's take a deep dive into what's going on here. Everybody in prison's monies is managed by the prison. And so if you want to buy something, this is probably for Secure Link, Securus Pack, or some, some one of those monopolies, you know, that take over and get all the, the business, that, that whole captive audience, okay? Let's see what we got. This is going to make me hot. Let's see what we got going in here, okay? Why they playing? I got to fill my form out, see what I want, y'all. What do I want, y'all? I don't even know if I got a pencil, bruh. Do I got a pencil to fill out the form, bruh? So shampoo. We don't know what kind of shampoo. That is a 34 ounce, 10 cents. Okay, 34 ounce shampoo bottle for 10 cents. Ain't that a plain size? Ain't that full size? They let you get up to 14 shampoos, y'all, because they know to wash this, is gonna take more than a little travel size, okay? I, I want, I don't know what kind of shampoo this is. I usually just use bar soap, but I'm gonna, I'm gonna get five shampoos, okay? So that's 50 cent off the bat. Y'all, how much for commissary? I make $40 a month training these CNI dogs. We got to reassess some things. Um, we're going to cut our phone calls in half. Book of stamps be a lot. And we pay the same price. We don't have a prisoner discount from USPS, okay? So let's just take, let's just round this up to 20. We have $20 to spend on commissary. So let's see what we can get. I'm going to get this deodorant stick. And I'm going to get five shampoos. Um, da, 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 da. I'm definitely going to get two of the petroleum jellies, um, cocoa buttercream. It's six ounces. I'll just get one. Okay. I don't need shaver. I wanted the cocoa butter soap. I wanted two of those. But they were expensive. It's going to be over a dollar, but I'm going to get two of them. Um, let's see. I definitely need a toothbrush toothpaste you guys let's just say this is a start over month you know we gotta we gotta restock all right oh this is a nice toothbrush it's 20 cents the denture brush is that for is that for something else i don't know we have a toothbrush Ooh, let's get some advil because you know how many be in there a two just two loop two little doo doots for 55 cents for two pills I guess I want a three pack. Ooh, this is the price. It's also tax on the item. These are tax paying citizens that can't vote. Okay, total tax and then the limit on how many things you can buy. Let's carry on. Uh, hemorrhoidal ointment, antifungal powder, corn removers. A comb. I guess I'll get one of those because I could, you know, be twisting a braiding hair and make a little bit of money on the side, you know. 
Now let's go on to the other side, see what else we need for the month. Um, ooh, envelopes. You guys know I need some envelopes. How many envelopes do you get? Uh, oh, this is the legal size. I just want the regular. Gum soft picks. Let me get some toothpicks for sure. I don't know why my pencil changed, but whatever. Envelopes, Unisource envelopes. This is this is the big envelope too. Is this the regular one? Verda envelope, shower shoes. You can only get one. I'm not gonna get none. I mean, but I need them, don't I? I thought you get those. They're three dollars and eighty-two cents, you guys. I don't even know what my total is at this point. I only have twenty bucks to spend because of the communications. Let's see. They got different shower shoes: tan, small, large, extra large. And I guess I'm gonna get a small shower shoe because I have to. Candy, manila envelope, another soap, earbuds. Oh, you got a ooh, 548 for the earbuds. That's the most expensive thing on here is headphones. You guys, how important is music just to be able to be in your own zone? The privilege of having your own sort of silence in a way. That is more than a quarter of what I have to spend. And Amani is coming out with finding fuel at the end of the month I feel like I need to get headphones I feel like I have to and they only have the clear ones there's no other types this is the only headphone available since the toothpaste I'm good metamucil a dandy shampoo a pumice sponge Ooh, potato chips I love me some regular potato chips let's have some potato chips oh and I would like a photo ticket when my people come two dollars though let me tell you this when your people come, they can buy the photo tickets. So we go ahead and buy it during the visit because I ain't got the money to buy it right now. You know, I would love to be able to say, bro, I got us photos, but I just can't. I literally can't. More potato chips and shower shoes and bagel chips, popcorn, jalapeno, cheddar. Ooh, that looks good. I'm gonna, I'm gonna add this. And then I'm gonna add everything up. Now, the first thing we have was five shampoos. That was 50 cents. Uh, the deodorant is 40 cents. The cough drops are 93 cents. Something that we really are going to need in this day and age. Petroleum jelly. I wanted a couple of those. I'm kind of regretting getting two. I think I'm just going to get one. <laughs> because, like, I wanted one for my hands and one for my feet. But I'm just feeling, okay, we're just going to type in what, what we wanted. But I'm feeling like that was not a good decision. So 175, da, 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 it's going to be another 150. Okay, cocoa butter cream, 116. That was also kind of like a thing I added. Uh, the cocoa butter soap is 65 cents and I wanted two of them. We just went over a quarter of our budget. We have our denture brush which I hope I can use on my teeth. It's the first brush I see. I wonder if people accidentally buy something and they're like, this is for something else. And I wasted my money. It's like I can go back to the store. I have to wait until I get another form and until the store opens back up. Like I can't just go to another store and get what I actually need. No, I have to wait. And then we got three Advils. Those were 55 cents each. So that's like 110 plus another 55 cents is 165 let's add that in and we're nearing halfway through our budget but we're halfway through the form so that's not too bad we wanted to get a comb that's just 11 cents and let's take it back over here we want some gum soft picks I didn't even realize how expensive those were like 4.97 just for some picks you know guys it's thin and I think it's thin for a reason let's come back to the picks because we got a toothbrush and, you know, I could probably just use some floss. I could probably bump some floss from somebody. Um, I'm going to get my headphones and stuff first because that's that's a quarter of the budget. That's three cents away from a quarter of the budget. So let's not add the picks yet. The shower shoes are 360. The earbuds are 548. We're going to need those to listen to Finding Fuel when that comes out. And the potato chips. Ooh, we're getting kind of close, you guys, but it's looking good. We haven't surpassed $20 yet. 
So let's do the whole shebang potato chips. It's a six ounce. It's a nice bag that we can indulge in. That is $1 and 75 cents. I've never heard of these brands too. Like <laughs> these brands are specifically for people in prison. Y'all gotta know. And then we've got the Moon Lodge popcorn jalapeno chips. And those are a dollar sixty. We're definitely not getting our toothpicks. That's for sure. Now let's add our phone calls. How much we had a two dollar and fifty fifty cent phone call every morning. I really said times five, but I should say the weekends too, you know, times seven. That leaves me with $2 at the end of the month. And that's without the video visit. Now, pro tip, the loved one who's who's getting the video visit can pay for it when they book me. So I'm not going to add that in. Um, I'm just going to save my $2 on a rainy day. I'll save my $2 towards release, okay? And if I save $2 a month at the end of the year, I'll have $24. And at the end of my 10-year sentence, I have $240. 10 years of saving and working every single month and actually keeping and maintaining a job that it could potentially be more. But yeah, I'll have to erase this. And hopefully I don't get penalized for doing that because I can't afford it. And then I'm just going to put in today's date. Let me finish filling out this form for you guys and put in the amount on the, the food order. I'll see y'all on the next one. Peace.